Hi, boys and girls. My name is Mr. Greg. I'm a reading helper with the 50 Forward Flip program. I'm excited today to read you this story, Sun Above and Blooms Below. It's written by Felicia Cherneski and illustrated by Susan Swan. Here's the opening picture to the book. What daffodils, Miss Ava cheered. The earth just blooms this time of year. Cooped up in school without a doubt. You've caught spring fever. We're going out. So there's a picture of a school, maybe like your school. And you can see this time of year, it's not the fall, it's the springtime. All the colors and the trees and the blossoms. And Miss Ava is the teacher. Take off your smocks and wash those hands. Put on your slickers. We have great plans. Our field trip will be so much fun. We'll see chicks hatch. Please walk, don't run. So there are the children getting ready for the field trip. We climbed into the empty bus and filled it full of all of us. There's the children on the bus. Waving as we pass through town, we soared up hills and flew back down. Can you see the bus going up the hill? From far away, a weather vane led us down a crooked lane, past straight wood fences, squat red pins. We parked near barns and clucking hens. You can see the picture of the barn, the red barn. Such funny birds, some big, some small, fluffy, feathered, short and tall. This next part is sort of funny. A rooster crowed atop the coop, and at the bottom, chicken poop. You can laugh. See all these roosters? Oh, there's the rooster and all these chickens. We giggled with our field trip buddies. The ground below, our boots was muddy. Above a sky of cloudy gray, drizzled on our sunny day. There's the children with their raincoats and their umbrellas. There's Miss Ava, the teacher. Miss Ava said, now don't complain. It's just a little April rain. Then Lily played the traffic cop. The geese can go, but you must stop. So there's Lily, there are the geese. A sign hung on the closed barn door. Open me, come in, explore. An old round wheel was nailed beside. The small square window, we went inside. I wonder what they're gonna find. Our slickers were wet, the hay bales dry. Two barnyard mousers loafed nearby. The white cat's name is Whisker Jack, the farmer said, and Buster's black. Can you see the two cats, Whisper Jack and Buster? <clears throat> we crowded around the incubator. It warmed so many eggs and later See all the eggs? We noticed cracks in just a few. What were those eggs about to do? What do you think they were about to do? Miss Ava hushed. Listen, watch. Peck, peck, peck. A chip, a notch. What do you think's happening? See the eggs? 
Some eggs stayed whole. Some eggs were broken. The hatching newborn chicks had woken. You can see. The farmer beckoned. Soon enough, these fragile chicks are sturdy puffs. We laugh to see them nestling, sleeping, and wide awake. Chicks hopping, peeping. See the little chicks? Miss Ava cried, how time does fly. We thanked the farmer and waved goodbye. Hello, blue skies and fresh, clean air. Spring opposites are everywhere. From rain to shine, with room to roam, our day away, now let us home. Have a great day, boys and girls. Mm -hmm.